hello everyone and welcome back to my channel if you are new here hi hello my name is Rashida and I am a stay-at-home work from home mom of four beautiful children we have Giselle who is eight Malachi is five Nasir is three and Naomi is currently 11 months and here on this channel we like to provide you with all types of motivation we have cleaning motivation laundry motivation mommy motivation just realistic motivation to help you get you through your day week month and year so if that is something that you're interested in please consider joining our family all you have to do is hit that subscribe button and make sure you turn your notifications on so you won't miss an upload so for today's motivation as you can tell by the title i am going to be cleaning my whole house so basically i am getting ready or this is the way that i get ready to go out of town I am actually going on vacation. The month is May when I am recording this and when you're watching it for the first time. But the month is May and my birthday is in May. My brother's birthday is in May. My dad's birthday is in May. My daughter's birthday is in May. There's just a lot going on in May. Mother's Day, you got Memorial Day. It's just a lot. Uh, May is probably my busiest month of the year as far as birthdays and parties and celebrations and holiday goes. But for my birthday this year, I'm actually going to be going out of town for the weekend and I'm actually leaving this weekend. But for the time you're watching this, I already went and came back. But for this video, I am actually just prepping my house to go out of town. Me personally, I like to clean and especially clean my whole house before I go out of town because once I come back, I know it's going to take me a minute to get back into my routines like my cleaning routines and things like that because i am really going on vacation mode and i'm not going to be thinking about cleaning and i'm not going to be thinking about when i come back right away so i just want to make sure that it's one less thing off of my plate to do once i come back and then i know i'm not the only one let me know in the comments down below but i love coming home to a clean home it's just something about that um maybe it's just the way i was raised we always had to clean before we left the house even for the day so it's just something about coming home to a clean home that just makes me happy As I said before, I am prepping to go out of town for the weekend. So I am trying to get caught up on certain house tasks that needed to be done, AKA the laundry. I'm always doing laundry, you guys. It's like, as soon as I get caught up on laundry, there's another five loads that just magically appear out of nowhere. So right now I'm just getting caught up on laundry and getting everything that I'm caught up on put away. So I won't have a huge pile when I return.
big area that I want to tackle before I leave is of course all of my catch-all areas and if you have been watching me for a while then you know this is one of my biggest catch-all areas this is actually in the living room or the family room whichever you want to call it but this is like the entertainment area the bar area and this is right beside the basement door so a lot of stuff that's on the main floor that needs to be taken downstairs it ends up right here and then it's just a lot of random stuff that ends up right here that we don't want on the floor that we don't want the baby to get to or we don't want the dog to get to. So this is just a high enough place for me to just stick stuff really quickly. And then again, the stuff that needs to go downstairs gets put right here as well.
moving on to the kids room i am not going to be doing too much in here i'm just going to be making their beds and putting away just some toys that's all over the floor i'm not going to be changing their sheets usually when i go out of town i like to wash the sheets right before we leave but i literally just did it the day before so today i'm just going to be just making up their beds As I mentioned before, I'm trying to take as much off my plate as I can for when I come back. And this is just one of the things that I needed to get done. I just wanted to not only just clean their room, but kind of deep clean it at the same time. I wanted to make sure that all the stuff from under the bed was taken care of and put back where it needs to be. I didn't want any trash or anything like that to be sitting up under the bed. So here I am just trying to get what I can reach. As you can see, I can't fit up under there i'm too big so the kids are gonna have to get the rest but for right now this is all the stuff that i can reach so you can just imagine the stuff back there that i can't reach another catch-all area this is outside of all the bedrooms again a lot of stuff that needs to go downstairs ends up right here and just a lot of stuff that just needs to be put back in up right here but mostly the stuff that needs to go downstairs because nine times out of ten if i'm going 
up and down the steps i usually have naomi in my hand so i'm not able to carry a lot of stuff down the steps so it just piles up right here so like i said i'm just trying to make sure that i do not have a lot waiting for me when i come back just so i will have a clear mind that i can actually enjoy being on vacation so i am just going to be really buckling down and getting this stuff done today the list of things to clean today is the kitchen so as you can see it's kind of cluttered there's a lot of stuff in here that doesn't belong and today we are just going to be putting everything back i'm not going to be doing a deep 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 clean because like i said we are leaving this weekend so we do have another day before we actually have to go but i wanted to get the cleaning done on this day because tomorrow or the following day is actually where i'm going to be prepping everything else as far as packing and doing everyone's hair and things like that so i just didn't want to do it all in one day because i was not trying to kill myself and be exhausted when we actually go out of town so i kind of just broke my stuff up into two days i got the cleaning and the laundry and everything dealing with the house I did that on this day and then the following day I did everything that was related to our person. So our hair, our packing, um, getting gas, getting snacks for the road, you know, just all that other miscellaneous stuff.
I really thought that this clip was funny because this happens all the time as I'm cleaning. That's why my house is never 100% clean. And she does this all the time. And I really think she's doing it on purpose. So it's so funny. As soon as I clean something, if it's in her reach, she's touching it. She wants to feel it. She wants to touch it. And I just think it's so cute for one. And two, it's kind of funny. All right, so I left this clip in on purpose and I should have kept the sound on, but I didn't. So basically I'm cracking up and I'm weak in the knees because my daughter had slid across the floor and it was just her comments that were hilarious. She wasn't hurt, you guys, so don't worry about that. But it was just so funny and the whole family just had a huge big old laugh about it. And I just wanted to take the time to show you guys this is what it looks like after vacuuming just about my whole entire house this was clean before I started vacuuming and now look how full it actually is just from the few rooms that I did you guys that is it for today's video i really hope you got tons and tons of tons of cleaning motivation go ahead and let me know in the comments down below if you have any upcoming trips that you are preparing for any summer vacations i know i have a few coming up as well so as always i appreciate you guys and i will see you in my next one what you think?